Hey, what's up guys? This is Nair Sheikh from blogdude.com and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to get back your terminated YouTube channel. As you all know, this week my YouTube channel was terminated without any reason and without any prior notification. And for a YouTuber, this is the worst thing that could ever happen to you. So I got my channel reinstated. And in this video, I'll show you guys how to get your YouTube channel back. So let's get started. Okay guys, so once your channel is terminated, you'll see something like this, which says this account has been terminated due to multiple or CVO violations of YouTube's policy against spam, deceptive practices and misleading content or other terms of service violations. Okay, so what you have to do is I have given three different links in the video description below. Open all the links in different tabs. Let's see the first link. When you open the first link, you will see this form. So what you have to do is just fill in this form. First is your name. So type in your full name. Second is email address you use to sign into your YouTube channel. So just put in that email address, whatever it is. Now here you have to put in the email address through which Google or YouTube can contact you. So you can basically put the same email address over there also. Just copy and paste it over there. Now here you have to put in the URL of the suspended YouTube channel. Okay, so let's come back to your page and your URL must look something like this, which should contain the channel name in between. For example, you see uh, there are different kinds of URL. Let me give you some example. For example, let me show you this youtube.com slash Nayashake. Okay, so this is also a URL, but you don't have to put this URL. The URL which you have to put should look something like this youtube.com slash channel slash the link or the ID of your channel. Okay, so what you have to do just copy this thing from here and paste it over here. Now here you have to put some good reason to YouTube that your channel should not be suspended or terminated. So you can type in something like this. Hello respected YouTube team. Recently my YouTube channel got terminated. I think my channel should not get terminated because I follow YouTube guidelines very carefully. Could you please recheck my channel to see if anybody has wrongly flagged my videos? I have given this in the video description below. You can just copy and paste it over here. So once you do that, just click on submit. Now let's come to the second form. Okay guys, as you can see, the second form also looks something familiar to the first one. Here also you have to put in your Gmail account in the first one. And the second one, the um, account through which they can contact you. And the third one is the reason that is this one. Just copy everything from here and again paste it over here. Okay, now let's come to the third form. So this is the third form. Okay, guys. so as you can see, it is asking a question. Do you sign into your Google account with a Gmail address? So what you have to do is just click on this yes and put in that Gmail address which you use to sign in to your Google account or your YouTube account. And again, uh, email address through which they can contact you. You can put the same, same email address or you can put different email address. And again, you have to type in the reason why your channel should not get suspended or terminated and then click on submit. Okay, so after filling all the three forms, you will get a reply from YouTube, which would look something like this. It says, hi there, after a review of your account, we have confirmed that your YouTube account is not in violation of our terms of service. As such, we have unsuspended your account. This means your account is once again active and operational. You will also receive one more email, which would look something like this from account appeal at youtube.com. So many a times, most of the times it happens that your account is unsuspended, but sometimes uh, it might happen that your account is still suspended. They'll give you the reason for that. For example, sometimes it might be spam or someone might have flagged your video or something. So what you have to do this your over here, you have to reply to YouTube again, type in the same thing and just add one more sentence that if my videos or any of my videos has violated your terms and conditions, then please remove and delete that video, but please give me back my channel. So hopefully after doing so, you'll get back your channel. It took around seven days for me to get a reply from YouTube. 
so you guys don't expect a prompt reply from YouTube many a times it happens that you get a reply within 24 hours or 48 hours but most of the time uh, it takes around five to seven days or sometimes even two weeks or three weeks and I hope this video has helped you guys if this video has helped you guys make sure you subscribe to my channel and also like this video so that this video helps other people also thank you for watching